this guys hey guys and welcome back to my youtube channel so currently we are on the way to go to PetSmart or Petco um, or Pet Supplies Plus one of those and we are gonna go ahead and we are going to be asking them if they have any senior hamsters or hamsters that have been returned that would possibly be up for adoption I am NOT going to be buying a hamster that is one thing that is certain but yeah, I don't know if there are any hamsters that are just have been there for a long time or anything like that. I really, really want a long haired Syrian. That is what I've been wanting for years. I'm so excited. And yeah, anyways, let's get on to PetSmart. <laughs> Y'all, we made it to PetSmart. Hopefully there'll actually be good stuff. <laughs> okay, so we just went into that PetSmart and it turns out that all of the animals that they had in that one, it was relatively small. Um, they all just got those hamsters in, so none of them were really adoptable. We would just have to buy them, which is not really the purpose of me trying to get a hamster um, because I was trying to adopt one so now we're going to be going to a bigger pet smart to see if there are any older or um, returned hamsters that i could possibly adopt and uh yeah all right guys part two hopefully they actually have some that i can adopt here Oh, hide it. One time me, Mickey, and Lauren devised a plan. We do a bunch of tourists and get them down to fire. Little buddy. But um, my number one thing would be is get the home base set and let her stay in that for a while. Okay guys, we just got it and I, okay, so it's a long story, but pretty much the hamster that I ended up getting was originally returned um, and it was in like quarantine in the back and they had it in like a super tiny little tub with only a hideout, some bedding that looked like so nasty and a water bottle and a food dish and that was it. And this guy is moving it around a lot. It is a, I'm gonna show you guys when um, we stop for a minute, but he's super cute and I held him and he didn't immediately bite me, which was a good sign. We did still have to pay for him though, which was kind of not the goal. Actually, I'll show you guys when we get home. Three hours later. Okay guys, so we just got home and I have my big bin cage that I just made and I need to hurry up and go ahead and fill it up with some bedding and toys and shoes and hideouts and I'm so excited, like literally. So this is just cat fresh that I had left over from my past hamster and if this does not fill up the whole cage then I will get some more because I already have some downstairs. And yeah, but he's been in that little box from PetSmart for a while since we did go to the grocery store after we got him. So I need to hurry up and do this. But yeah, I'm just going to film me setting up the cage.
right, you guys, this is honestly the moment of truth. Um, we're about to release him and let you guys see him for the first time. So, yeah. Okay. There he is, guys. So cute. Here he is. He is blonde. He has really cute markings on him. I know you guys probably couldn't see him. Oh my God, he's adorable, guys. Let him in there. I know. Okay. Why is it so dang hot here? Okay, I'm just gonna let him out slowly. I'm living. He is so soft. Oh, see, he's kind of skittish, but He's so freaking soft. Oh my gosh. There he is. No. His first tastes of freedom. Freedom Guys, these are his first moments of freedom. Oh my god, he's really hungry. He is honestly kind of skinny for a Syrian. So they were probably starving him. Um, so this is kind of like his little cage. If you guys couldn't see, he has a eight inch wooden wheel. If that is too small for him, I will be upgrading. Um, a sand bath, just some fun things that he can kind of experiment with and see what he likes. I still need to find a way to put some water in this bin cage. Um, so that's definitely very important, but that is what we got going on right now. We're just gonna okay, watch him. I did notice he had that weird tail thing going on. What do you mean? That's his little tail. He's so cute. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. was returned but he seems really nice and I really don't know why he was returned at the moment. They said that he was around eight months old but to be quite honest he does not look that old at all and I am going to be just leaving him alone to kind of just settle in for the next little while but yeah he's kind of just exploring at the moment. Guys he's running on the wheel for the first time. Cute. <laughs> he's probably hasn't had a wheel in like forever so yeah just getting to see him run on it is amazing like guys I'm not going on YouTube <sighs> I'm sorry I'm just like freaking out in this video but this is just my raw reaction I absolutely love hamsters and just this moment, like getting a new hamster, is just something that I have been wanting for so long. Melodies we haven't played. No, I don't want no rest. Echoing around these walls, fighting to create a song. I don't want to miss a beat. We'll go. chew and he's already like eating it he loves it oh my gosh this is like the best moment of my life he probably has like really long teeth because he was not given any chews so I'm really glad that he likes that he has not figured out the concept of water yet and I'm going to attempt to give him a treat. Oh, no, he doesn't want it. 
I'm still scared of humans, but you'll get used to it. He really doesn't want to go in his hide house, which is kind of nice because we get to see him explore. Guys, this is within like the first 15-ish minutes and he's already like burrowed like all around his cage and he's like put a bunch of stuff in his food dish but we just had to get it out and now he's like tipping over his wheel. So I think he really is enjoying this at the moment. And that just shows you guys how much he was not getting. He is just absolutely loving all the space that he's getting. If I could get him another cage, I think that he would enjoy that as well. Um, but we're, I think we're just going to have to stick with his 105 quart bin cage at the moment. And yeah, I think he's just loving it. And I love seeing him just really explore like this. It's awesome and so rewarding to see. Alright you guys, so that pretty much sums up today's video. I am legitimately so happy with like today. I cannot be more excited to have this new little guy in my life. I am literally just like, ah, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, so that pretty much sums up today's video. I will see you guys in my next one. Also, please make sure to comment down below if you want to see any more videos with little hammy back there. I really don't know what to call him right now. So yeah.